Hola, vamos a aprender sobre lección 8, o presente de ir. So here are the conjugations of the verb ir. Just a reminder, ir means to go. So we have voy, vas, va, vamos, vais, van. The use of ir, it means to go, and we can use it in the uh, construction ir plus a plus infinitive, and we use this to talk about things that are going to happen in the future. Without leaving, the future, uh, without leaving the present tense. So voy a practicar para el examen. I'm going to practice for the test. Or vas a escribir una carta a tu amigo. You are going to write a letter to your friend. Uh, it also can be used, ir can also just be uh, used to go to a place, which points not talking about future events. You can just say uh, voy a la escuela, I'm going to the school, or I go to the school. I go to school, either one of those works. Um, but if it's in the ear plus a plus infinitive, if that construction it's used to talk about something you are going to do in the future. Uh, also, just uh, within this, uh, kind of a, a counterpart to ir is the construction acabar plus de plus infinitive. So this uh, doesn't use ir, but it does similar things. It allows you to talk about something that has just been done in the past without leaving the present tense. So uh, kind of similar idea, instead of going forward, it goes in reverse just a little bit. So ellos acaban de llegar al restaurante, they just arrived at the restaurant. So it's kind of the nice little counterpart to ear plus a plus infinitive is acabar plus day plus infinitive. El fin.